Jordan, when you, when you guys saw that they beat UCLA the other night, I mean, did that get some extra attention there on behalf of, you know, just knowing what they were capable of? Uh, yeah, we knew we knew they were a good team going into the game. We uh, watched a couple of clips from last year, and they were in. They were actually beating a couple of teams that were ranked top twenty-five and up. So we never want to underlook our opponents, and we knew they would be a good uh, good matchup going in. Jordan, you guys had great balance tonight. Um, five guys in double figures, three guys, four guys right around twenty points. Coach talked about making that <coughs> pass and playing together as a team. Do you feel like that's starting to come together already this season? Oh, yeah, definitely. While we were in the offseason, we watched a lot of uh, clips on uh, the Spurs and the Hawks, and so we want to imitate the way they play, uh, just move the ball, make the extra pass, and uh, shoot open shots. Hey, Nick, uh, there's a lot of offensive rebounds uh, from Mondo and the first half. What did you guys do in the second half to kind of I mean, we put a lot of emphasis on that to box out and make sure to grab every single board, defensively, of course, defensively. Yeah. How's that, your shoulders feeling? Uh, my shoulders feel fine. I mean, I got to lift a lot more than I did the previous year, so I put a couple, uh, muscle, a couple of muscles on. And um, I'm taking rehabbing every day and uh, icing them after every game and stuff like that. You had the tape on your left shoulder tonight. Was that related to any of that, or is that just? Uh, yeah, I mean, just precautious things. You know, James Harden wears it. A couple other NBA players wear it, and just a mental thing. Nick, obviously, like a lot of the other big men were in foul trouble tonight. What was your point of emphasis when you're out there knowing that, you know, your other fellow big men were in foul trouble? Is there anything you were trying to do specifically? I was just trying to play clean defense, uh, be able to recover all the time and help my teammates out. But, and I think I did a really good job. Do you feel like they were calling it kind of tight out there? Uh, yeah, 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 it was. And our team was trying to get us in foul trouble. I think that was their game plan. So, Jordan, some of this was, was forced by uh, fouls and just by their lineup, but you had four guards out there at the end. What's that dynamic like? Do you, do you like playing with that small lineup? I mean, I feel like we could compete with anybody on the floor. You know, we all uh, do similar things. We're all, some people are athletic, some people can shoot the ball better than others. So, but we just, uh, we just play depending on how the game is going. You know, like they said, we were, they're calling a lot of fouls with all the uh, new rules, but we just something we just have to adjust to in the future. Question for either one of you. Do you think that this is a game you would have won last year with the other team kind of comes back, gets back into it? Do you think the fact that you guys are more older, more experienced, that you kind of know what to do in these situations now? You want that one? I mean, I'll take <laughs> it. Uh, I mean, definitely. I think uh, we improved a lot from uh, last year. Uh, we have all the guys returning. I think the only thing in Pi 12 he has uh, that uh, luxury. So, and all, everybody worked a lot during the off season and summer, and uh, everybody grew as a player. So, I think it's a good win, and we just need to forget about it and get ready for New Mexico next Saturday. How about your first half? You were perfect from the field, 14 <coughs> points. I mean, I was just trying to do my work. So, and they weren't able to stop me, and we were trying to <laughs> focus on that. Were you a little motivated from the last game? Like, what? I mean, yeah, that's a normal thing. Sometimes you can start off uh, your season slow, and uh, but we have a great team, so like other guys were able to step up. One night is some guy, one night the other. So it really doesn't matter who scored the ball; it matters the wins. Jordan, you played a lot with Julian out there tonight. I guess probably something that you guys want to do this season. How's that going? Uh, it's, going, kind of the point guard it's going well, you know, we, either of us can bring it up the floor and we, uh, we both know the positions at the one and two very well. We, we should know one through five because we, uh, we're a coach on the floor, so we got to make sure everybody's in the right position. But uh, us being on the floor at the same time, we complement each other. So it's, I'm fine with it. Who's normally <laughs> the point guard when you're both out? Uh, it's just whoever gets it and pushes it. Other other uh, wings fill the lanes. Uh, the only time it's designated is when a uh, coach draws up a play. That's the only time it's designated. Five guys in double figures. Is that what you guys want for the whole season to be able to push the ball like that? And as many people score as they can. Uh, yeah, we just want to, uh, our motto is play fast, play smart, play unselfish. So, you know, we uh, just play fast, play smart, and then wh whoever has a wide open shot, take it with confidence and knock it down. What, is it? what if any adjustments did you guys make when Mom went on that big run to get back in the game? Um, we, just, we just stuck together. We said uh, we're just going to play our defensive rules, and then uh, towards the second half, we uh, when um, the guard, number 12, got hot, we uh, decided to trap on the ball screens, 
and then everybody just rotate over from there. So it was just little things uh, throughout the game. This was the first time USC scored over 100 points in a game since 2002. Well, what do you think of that? I didn't know about it. <laughs> uh, yeah, I didn't either, you know. But that's what we want to do, you know. They say first to 100 wins. And so I guess that was true tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Penny looked pretty uh, frustrated on the bench. Was there anything that you guys uh, told him to uh, kind of calm him down? Uh, I mean, we, everybody everybody talked to him on the bench. You know, it's a collective effort, and uh, he got yeah, he was a little frustrated. But we told him, you know, you just got to adjust to the way the refs are calling it, especially with the new rules now. So he'll be all right. How comfortable are you guys with all the rotation that you're doing? Um. I'm fine with it. I mean, I get, give my rest time whenever I'm coach thinks I'm tired or if I, he thinks I need a break, he can take me out. Uh, as long and then, whenever we need somebody playing a certain, doing the certain thing that they do best, he'll put them in at the right time. So I think coach does a great job with that. Yeah, I agree with Jordan. They're always trying to find the right combination to win a game, and uh, that's a better question for them, not for us. <laughs> Yeah, I'm working on it every day. It just depends like who I'm playing against. So if it opens up, I'm going to shoot it. And yeah. Are you guys good? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.